Hi everyone, Aldous Syk here. Um, today I'm going to do a very short video on fundamental attribution error. This is for informational purposes only. Uh, I took a lot of the information from a book called The Wisest One in the Room um, from 2015, Gilovich and Ross. And then other sources in my notes uh, I've used, and of course my own uh, interpretation of information. So, what is um, the definition of fundamental attribution error, or FAE? Okay, we overestimate the extent to which people's actions, especially their successes and failures, and their displays of apparent virtue or vice, are reflections of the kind of people they are, and underestimate the extent to which they are a product of situational influences. Okay, so a lot of times we just uh, react to how a person behaves positively or negatively, and we don't take into consideration the situation that the person happens to be in at the time. And we're all susceptible to this uh, FAE, function, fundamental attribution error. Okay, so an example that was in the book of FAE was when... Uh, Hurricane Katrina hit. People who stayed behind were labeled as foolish and lazy, even though in most instances uh, they didn't have the means to to leave. And then the people that actually left, you know, they were labeled as intelligent by a lot of people. Okay, um, so you can see where it's, it's maybe unfair to uh, do so, and that's the FAE in operation there. And, you know, if uh, you could probably look at situations at work, you know, with coworkers, easy to point fingers, you know, like if they come in late, you know, or you think, you know, okay, you know, that person doesn't really care about uh, this job. Uh, but do you know the circumstances as to why they're coming in late? Is there a sick child, car problems, uh, other scenarios that that could come up okay so it's um, sometimes good just to kind of step back reflect on what possibilities there may be before we you know jump the gun and come to and draw a conclusion about what's going on and on my example so when I drive um, the Southern California freeways it's inevitable that I'm going to see or have to uh, navigate away from somebody that's tailgating me or weaving in and out of traffic. And inevitably, in my mind, I think, what a jerk. Um, but really, I don't have all of the information at my disposal. You know, does he have a sick child laying down on the seat that he's rushing to the hospital okay and even if uh, that's not the say the best way to deal with the situation if I knew that if, if I knew that he had a sick child in the car I'm sure that my anger toward him would dissipate okay um, and uh, just one more reminder uh, remember that FAE works both as a positive and a negative, almost kind of related to, you know, the halo effect and horn effect, um, which uh, I have a video on if you don't know what that is. Ah, so back to the book. Um, here's a, something I took from it. To be the wisest one in the room, discipline yourself not to rush to judgment about individuals until you know and feel you truly appreciate the situational forces and constraints that are making their influence felt. Okay, and finally, if you happen to be uh, in Southern California on Southern California freeways and you happen to see me weaving in and out of traffic, remember I am not a jerk, at least usually. Okay, and we are done with this video.